There's too much hate here Put your light is in the sky For your people that ain't here Money on my mind Team that loves to grind Always put in overtime Cause we don't take a day off Hustles where you at We be reppin' mass Staying focused on the racks We don't take a day off Money on my mind Team that loves to grind Always put in overtime Cause we don't take a day off just like a word to the wise, right? Yeah. If you see somebody literally falling down slowly, uh -huh. don't go and help them because there's no sense in having two people on the ground. Yeah. And I mean that like literally. I'm not. This isn't like a metaphorical. Like someone slipping down a hill and going in depression. I'm saying if somebody's literally falling down, yeah. And it's taking them a long time to get down. You uh -huh. just let that shit happen. Okay. You don't want to go up okay. in that. You want to go up. Well, down. I mean, I, here's the thing, though. Everybody's first initial reaction is usually if you're not a piece of shit to try to help someone. So I don't think that. No, I get work. that. I mean, <laughs> uh, I, uh, I'm not going to mention any names, but I grew yeah. up with a slow faller a as slow a relative. Faller. A slow now, faller is this as a like relative. the Matrix type shit? No, exactly. Like, okay. And it kind of like, like on the way down, yeah. it seems like they could take out anything they wanted to. You know, it's like <laughs> slow. Like I have a conversation. So it was like, went up to. Uh, uh, restaurant around here and we're like we step up there's like a bar right here you walk in with a bunch of chairs around yeah. it and then you know the dining's over here so we go and the boy just walks up and how many take your order uh -huh. and this person just started falling across like the bar stools and stuff down there okay. and I'm like so I'm just like looking at it I'm like it's okay this shit happen it happens all the time we'll have two but we'll just let it finish <laughs> it your fall up. thing and she was still falling after I said that to a lady <laughs> I was like don't worry there's no sense in helping her because she's just gonna take me down with her he's like you know what I'm saying so it's just a funny little always letting old ladies just drop in this bitch yeah I was like well, look at that we got it but it's cool so, you know, uh, know but yeah I mean what up yo welcome back to Boot What's TV this? once again episode Try episode three, and yeah. uh, you know today uh, today's gonna be cool because uh, you know we're gonna be it's we're gonna be interviewing someone, and, and it's, it's the Christmas. day before oh, yeah, Christmas. Day before Christmas. Day before Christmas. We're so. gonna let up on this, even during holidays. No. We don't take no break. No, we don't take no days off. So you want to come and get interviewed? You contact either That's me right. or BBT. We will interview you. Yeah, we will. We will. We will absolutely interview. We'll absolutely push your yeah. shit. You know what I mean? That's Honestly, what we're all about. This we episode, we're um, not gonna be doing any of the ghetto grub. No, nope. you know we're gonna. Um, we have a guest. Yeah, we have a guest. And uh, uh, um, so, why don't you uh, why don't you tell us a little so bit about it's, him? It's my uh, it's my brother James, and he's been doing photography for for a long time. And you know, it's just like weird, like just seeing him since he started. Yeah, it's like now, like I'd be Absolutely. up for sign. I never got Watching it. Like grow and shit. When he yeah. was gonna go do like pictures, he'd just be standing out on the back back deck, just like looking at the sky. Right. And I was kind of like maybe he's getting in the Zen thing. Right. What he was doing, he was like reading like the cloud movement, uh -huh. like where the clouds are gonna end up, to, like to determine. Like where he go take photos. Like he sometimes he likes clouds in yeah. it with like the sun in the background. Yeah, sometimes yeah. he doesn't. But he just look up and had like, you know, five or six different shooting places. But just yeah. by looking up at the clouds for a little bit and just yeah. like thinking about it, he just always like managed to avoid yeah. them to go out. You know. Well, I mean, photographers do that. You know what I mean? They, um, you know, I don't think a lot of people realize how much thought actually goes into setting up a shot. Yeah, um, you know. You know, and it's good that we have him on here. You know, to explain a little bit. You yeah, know, you know, BBT is gonna be doing some interviewing there. Yeah, It'll yeah, be a good yeah. thing. I'm just wanted to give that little intro for brother. And, yeah, uh, absolutely. You know, um, but you know, before we get into that, yeah, you know what time it is, right, Paul? And then before, what are we talking about? Here? What are we talking about? Yeah. You know what it is, bro. Oh, is this us versus, versus them? them. That's oh right. man, See, it's I'm back. out of my mind. It is the day before Christmas. That's and right. I've really uh, done no shopping. You know what's funny? It's the day before Christmas, um, and and we didn't even we haven't even said uh, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. Yeah. What up to everybody out everybody, there? Like Hope everybody has a good time. Be safe. Uh, absolutely. You know be what safe. I'm saying? Party good. Yeah. You know, I think it's a good idea. Like. Absolutely. The more drunk you get, the more you should lose your fucking keys. Like literally, don't don't be run driving around like a dumbass. Yeah, you know, no, like, don't. No, no, no. Don't uh, be stupid. We we fully we fully support the don't drink and drive and mentality. Just, really, right especially during the holidays, the people Absolutely. just uh, they're not paying attention. Yeah, there's you know? a lot of people who got a lot you of know? distractions. A lot of and kids. And you really want to keep your eyes on the prize here, people. Absolutely. That's what we're trying to do. Uh, but you know, let's uh, you. let's get into this us versus them. So uh, right? here we go again. Right. Let's do it. Yeah, son. Yeah, that's right. Huh. Us, Us versus, versus them. them. Ghetto Booth Chronicles. Chronicles, son. Pauly uh -huh, P. I see you. BBT. Hope they see me. <laughs> that's right. We just do whatever the fuck that we please. You could say. 
that they the truest MCs to ever breathe All the beats do it so easily Yeah, that's right, me and Pauly P, we call the shit a breeze and That's why we like to freestyle on these beats You never let up on these beats Well, it's brain after heat Cause the beats, they meant for me They meant to be released with such extreme heat That everybody needs to bring fire extinguishers to come and see the GBC Ha! We going crazy, maybe you motherfuckers think we were lazy Back in the day, see, we weren't trying to push it see, But this time, we coming back to push the shit Right in what? your face, that's it, it's right. over, but get a boot this hit Yeah, we were never pushing this shit Cause I was too busy pushing too much shit And I was trying to do too much shit And all my shit's neat now, so get with it, kid We up in the GBC, the podcast, it's real fucking neat Why don't you look that shit up on YouTube or on the what? Bow News Battle TV, News, baby. Boo TV. That's right, we be the illest up on the fucking scene. You could never see me, BBT, or Pauly P, the GBC. Do it for eternity. And we make you turn. Motherfuckers ain't concerned with the words you use. We gonna come in the game, you'll learn that the GBC gonna be the one setting the game on fire. We gonna be the one sitting on top. You could just say they ride us. Huh. We be abusing the shit. We be riding up on it. Got a little intuition on us. So we keep on building the stuff. We gotta keep on mixing the stuff in. And to get a boost in the poly P. And we gonna be doing this shit every fucking week. So you gotta used to seeing me. I think my lyrics is fucking whack. I don't give a fuck, dude. Go smoke a blunt and fucking get over it. Get over with that. Yeah, it's fucking mumble rapping from here. I don't give a fuck, man. Just probably pay y'all up in your motherfucking ass, yo. Ha, ah, that's right. We just coming through the game and act tight. Every time, the last time. Last time. Coming through, we decided to blaze. So, it's like I'm still high, high for days. Ha. Oh, who would have known that we could just smoke so much motherfucking ganja up in this bitch? Don't even roll. We just hit it so, and we just hit it mo. And we just keep on hitting the shit till we hit the flow. And the fire patrol be knocking on my door. Like, yo, what's up with all this smoke, though? I'm like, it's just Gandhi. We just how we roll, man. You want a blunt? You want to light out for me? Let's get that fire thing out of here, man. We love fucking hot box and shit. Just make my eyes freeze. A little sticky. Like the sticky icky that we put in between that blunt wrap. And we fucking got all the shit out of them. I'm like that tobacco shit whacking. And we're kind of smoking on a fucking grass, kid. Straight up grass and fucking, fucking, fucking mass, yeah? Yeah, us versus them. Them versus Hit us? up, dog. In huh. the end. What's up, you want to see the podcast? Shit. Check it out. Boop TV, son. Peace out, dog. It's over with. And that was Rap Battle Dash ENS on YouTube. Look it up. Yes, What's the name of the beat? Yes, sir. And the, the name of that beat was Flow Trick. Um, so, you know, just like always, you know, MCs yeah. that want to get involved, you can put your submissions to us versus them for at gmail.com. Dot com. Uh, you know, and as soon as uh, you want to participate in this us versus them, I mean, yeah. honestly, even if you don't want to participate, we're still going to be doing yeah, this. Yeah, at least do me a favor and just say, you guys suck in the comments. <laughs> and it's okay. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know, whatever. I, I mean, mean, like I said, fucking job, guys. even, even if it's us you. versus them, I mean, we'll just get more and more talk shit yeah. like, and we'll just be like yo if nobody wants to respond i guess we're the best in the we'll world we'll just have to go against each other every damn time <laughs> and so it'll be like two beats you're gonna have to hear this twice as much because yeah. we'll have to double like he'll do a beat and i'll do a beat or something <laughs> uh, we'll just go like half way through the beat who did yeah. the better yeah. i don't know we'll figure it out whatever we'll you, vote on our you own guys shit. Are, you get you're stuck with us no matter what I mean, that's right we're gonna do, you know? do this uh, but yeah, no, it's uh, it's good because right now we're gonna get into that interview. So uh, you know we're gonna bring our friend James on the scene, which is my brother. That's his brother. Lost um, nights. So check us out, and uh, we're gonna talk to him a little bit about his photography. Yes, yeah, so yes, you go. are. And pay attention, people. All right, you guys interact. Yeah, buddy. So uh, right now uh, I got a good friend of mine joining us in Boot TV. Uh, that's Mr. James Pirelli. What's up, son? What's going on, brother? No, just chill, man. How you doing? How you excellent. doing? Excellent, excellent. Uh, holidays, so of course, Merry Christmas. Likewise. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know what do you uh, what are you doing for the holidays, my friend? I'm uh, mostly just sticking around here. Gonna go out and do some photo work where I can. Absolutely. Have some fun doing that. Yeah, you're gonna freeze your balls off. You take some good pics though. Uh, I don't usually freeze my balls off. I no. dress I dress well for the winter. Yeah, mm -hmm. I, I don't sometimes. I just double up sweatshirts and freeze my tits off. Uh, but that's life, you know what oh, I mean? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yeah. So uh, you know, you're gonna uh, you're gonna be joining us today. To talk a little bit about your uh, your photography. I, I assume, right? Yes, absolutely. Yep, yep. So why don't you tell us a little bit about that? Uh, just been having fun with it, man. It's a passion of mine. Yeah. Um, 
been working really hard at it for a long time now. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, what's the name of that again? It's Last Night's Photography. Last Night's Photography, absolutely. Uh, yeah, you take a lot of a lot of really cool shots. Uh, you know, you've you've done so much work for the Ghetto Booth. You know what I mean? We truly appreciate it. That's why I wanted to have you on as, as our first guest. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Um, yeah. You know, so so when you when you talk about the the passion that you have for photography, uh, what where did that come from? Like, what got you into it? Uh, uh you know, oddly enough, it was. I originally wanted to get into making video, like okay. doing stuff like this, like just making my own okay. web stuff. And yeah. uh, I realized that that's a shit ton of work. That is a lot of work. Like a shit ton of work. Trust me, I know. And I'm like <laughs> when the, the stuff that I wanted to do would have required a lot of people. And, yeah. you know, like it was always fun when everybody got together and we'd screw around and right. do some stuff, but you nothing ever came to, of it. Yeah, you never get to accomplish anything because people weren't all in. And so I, yeah. I would go out and like practice some of the shots that I would want to get. Yeah. Uh, for the uh, filming wise, and I yeah. just ended up liking photography. Nice. Fell and, in uh, love with it. You know. So so what are some of your uh, what are some of your favorite spots to take shots at? Uh, I'd have to say uh, sunset wise yeah. um, would probably be Damon's Point. Okay. And okay. You know that that's a local spot. Everybody right. loves it. Yeah. Or um, also the Situate Lighthouse okay, on yeah. the right days. Lighthouse. I like lighthouse shots. Yeah. Yeah, they're definitely pretty cool. And Yeah, uh, for sure. It's f I never really got into, uh, like, uh, waterscape landscape stuff until much later on. Right. I originally got into night stuff. Right, right, and right. And over time, my schedule just sort of fell into it. Right. And I just fell in love with it. It's yeah. They're both really easy times to have free time to be able to go out and do it yeah what so what's your favorite kind of shot like um if you could if you could if you could describe your your perfect shot what do you think that would be none of mine <laughs> uh that's i mean that's what i shoot for right okay okay and do you have any I kind suppose. of like preference on um like do you like to shoot events or do you whether do like wildlife or things out in the nature do you like have people in there uh i've recently gotten more and more in uh confident i should say into doing uh work for people okay. specifically because I, I never really wanted to charge for it because i never had a full grasp on everything that i was doing okay. up until recently i've gotten a lot more confident with with what uh, you're doing everything i'm doing yeah well i mean it's just like anything else even with us and our music it's all about practice you know what i mean the more and more you do it and it's always good that you actually enjoy what you're doing you know what i mean it's 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 almost like it's not work at that point point. and but it's i was thinking about this the other day it's yeah. funny because the uh better and better i get i yeah. find the less and less serious i take myself yeah i don't know if that makes any sense uh like i just want to achieve more and I guess would hope that I would be doing more but yeah. I, also I'm just kind of like enjoying what you're doing I, I love it so much that I don't even care yeah like I don't yeah, I don't so do it's a it good, to it's a, good, it's a good way to do yeah yeah honestly I mean and, and here's the thing it's kind of the same concept with, with our music it's like uh, we do it because we love it um, but you know it's no reason why we shouldn't put the work and the effort to try to build something out of it and maybe it becomes big maybe it becomes you know a monetary thing um, but you know, even if it doesn't, it's not like we're going to stop. You know what I mean? Yeah. We're going to just keep doing it. It's because passion. And that's that's what's interesting about art is that it takes dedication Yeah. more than anything. And while you shouldn't force yourself when you don't have the creativity, uh -huh. it's work to be consistent. It's yeah. work to be consistent. Consistency is definitely the key. Consistency and is all that makes somebody uh, different from an amateur to a pro you know what i mean absolutely yeah consistency is good and you, you've been building on that you know i've been definitely watching some of your stuff i uh, see your, your posts on facebook try to like you know, as much as i can actually trying to break my own bad habit of not doing that you yeah. Know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah but that's cool um so uh right now i believe we got a slideshow to play yep. um put something together for us and uh we're gonna play your favorite ghetto booth chronicle song because uh we know you love this song oh it's one of my favorites yeah absolutely it's, so speaking of inspiration it's a big inspiration to me it's one on one of my playlists when i go out so, yeah yeah oh nice. of course yeah i mean you know you've always been a, a big supporter so um you know let's uh let's let the folks check that out all right so uh we'll be back in a minute They see 
see the sun is too bright, but I shine harder. Money on my mind, my mind on the money all the time. Eyes on the dollar signs. Gotta get it while the game's good. Live it today, not tomorrow. They say the sun is too bright, but I shine harder. Money on my mind, my mind on the money all the time. Eyes on the dollar signs. Gotta get it while the game's good. Live it today, not tomorrow. So long. It's time for me to fade away There's money on my mind so my mind is on getting paid With every breath I take And every move I make I know there's a cost And death is debt we get to pay Living is hard We was given the gift of God To be able to make music It's fit from the heart Sicker than the bubonic clay Mix the f*** in the car Stick to my guns Close your eyes and listen to pictures of the boss We got a money scheme with funny dreams To own a hundred MCs And have them all gunning for me When it's the rise of the GBC Keep all eyes on BBT See if I don't ride until the day I was out Six feet deep, that's a thoroughbred Heroic, heavenly sent Devil in the flesh, heaven helped him with seven sins And in seven days he'll destroy anything made against His name will the click that he claims That he'll yeah. ever trying to do They say the sun is too bright, but I shine harder Money on my mind, my mind on the money all the time Eyes on the dollar signs Gotta get it while the game's good Look at today, not tomorrow They say the sun is too bright, but I shine harder Money on my mind, my mind on the money all the time Eyes on the dollar signs Gotta get it while the game's good Live it today, not tomorrow Got my money on my mind, got my honey on my mind Got no direction, mind so there's no way to find it Money on my mind so I'm spread thin Money all the time, so I got time to spend. I blend ends, don't pay back. I still got ends to spend. Get ends like hundreds of Benjamin. And I'm independent and I paid my rent. Got my money spent. Got it from me, that's my honey level. Like papers, my pens. Protect them both like I'm the guardian. Rhyme slow like I inspired. I guess don't stop with this. Shine like a thousand watts. HID, y'all know it's HPS. Which means I got the shine for all seasons. He's got rhyme for when he's pee, for when he's beefing. It's like rhyme is a GBC, Tourette's tendency. This shit's involuntary. What up? Yeah. They say the sun is too bright, but I shine harder. Money on my mind, my mind on the money all the time. Eyes on the dollar signs. Gotta get it while the game's good. Live it today, not tomorrow. They say the sun is too bright, but I shine harder. Money on my mind, my mind on the money all the time. Eyes on the dollar signs. Gotta get it while the game's good. Live it today, not tomorrow. They say the sun is too bright, but I shine harder. Money on my mind, my mind on the money all the time. Eyes on the dollar signs. Gotta get it while the game's good. Live it today, not tomorrow. They say the sun's too bright, but I shine harder. I was like, money really on my excited when you guys had asked me to come in and be involved with it. Yeah. Because I've been, you know, helping you guys yeah. where I could in the background, just doing Absolutely. little, uh, whatever, you know. Yeah. And um, all kinds of shit. It's it's really great for artists to have people who are doing stuff for them. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. I mean, that's that's pretty much why we're doing this. You know what I mean? Like, one thing we always try to say in every episode is, like, we're here to try to promote other people as much as ourselves. You know what I mean? And that's, that's why we'll have as, anybody that wants to come on, you know what I mean, come and do the thing. Uh, definitely. I'm, you know, we're excited to have you here, man. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Yeah. And so, uh you know what kind of what kind of shit you got going on? Who tell you about a little bit of the get up booth? If you like, yeah, I would love to hear about it. What are you guys working on? Like well, uh, we got the chapter three yep. coming out. That's actually in post production, um, and then we also have chapter four in the works. I'd say that's you know, not counting production shit. That's probably maybe forty percent done. Excellent. Yeah, excellent. You know what I mean? um, we haven't really been doing too many shows, but you know us. We'll get back into that eventually. Um, that's pretty much it. I mean, and now are you guys? Uh gonna do any sort of big release on the rework that uh we're at? for we actually rework in chapter two so um one of the things we never did was like equalize shit yep and you know a lot of people that we've been playing music to recently have been telling us about like the difference in the effects and they so minor but important you know what i mean especially when somebody's trying to blast music in the car you don't want their fucking ears to bleed you know what i mean um so we are going to do a post uh re-release of that album now we're gonna change the scheme. It was a whole black thing. We're yep, gonna yep. change it to like a white scheme for the thing. I gotcha. Um, and then you know, once that comes out, we're just gonna probably sign like twenty of them, autograph them, and just ship them out to like uh, the people that are uh, want one. You know what I mean? Our fans. You know. And, and now let me ask you when you, when you went back and started like going over some of that stuff. Yeah. Did it was it like uh, did you take any of the songs in differently? Oh, um, absolutely. I mean the the. 
it's kind of tough sometimes because we kind of do everything all ourselves, right? Yep. And But once we learned, like, we watched some YouTube videos, we did a little bit of tutorial shit and, you know, kind of researched how to do, like, equalizing, for example. And when we did it, it's like we sat there and we realized, like, that CD's so fucking ill. And we never really did anything with it. Um, it has, like, live people playing the saxophone on it. It has all this stuff. And when you equalize that, you can really draw out the sounds that are, are very pleasant to the ear. Um, and we cut out a lot of, like, the white noise that you would hear that it was. And yep. the overall feel of it just, it became so smooth. You know what I mean? And Absolutely. It was, we were pumped when we were listening to it, like, jumping around. We were like, yeah. And I, was, you know I, mean? I was having tons of fun uh, watching you guys go through that. Yeah. Because it was, uh, yeah. it had a whole different, envi- like, uh, atmosphere. Yeah. While you guys were working on that. Yeah, I there mean, was... the Chapter 2 CD was unique because that's when we kind of first... Um, Reclicked up. Yeah. After all that bullshit, you know what I mean. And songs were coming like fire back then. You guys were just yeah. writing stuff like crazy. I yeah. think I heard you guys record songs that just never even. Yeah. Oh, we definitely have songs we never yeah. even release. I mean, yeah. that's the thing. Like sometimes um, we're kind of our own uh, worst enemy because we just like we like the train that keeps going. Yep. You know I mean? and yeah. And sometimes you got to kind of like, whoa, well, let me pump the brakes and finish this. Um, that's another thing that we've been working on, you know what I mean? And we've definitely taken cues from people like you, um, you know what I mean? The the progression that I've seen in your shit and your work and even the way you present yourself um, has come so much in such a short time, you know what I mean? And really looking forward to seeing where, where you go with it. Just having fun with it, man. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, but Like you said, I hope to one to get that picture. When yeah. I find it, I'll show it to you. Yeah, I I I, I hope to see it. Um, and I believe that we were talking about um, you were gonna maybe put some prints out to people, um, and we were gonna autograph them for them and, and send it out. You still want to do that? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, absolutely. Okay. Anybody uh, who's supporting anybody, I try to, uh, you know, to do. show my appreciation to. Yeah. Um, so, you know, what we'll do with that is, uh, you know, the first five people to comment and, and interact with it, we'll, we'll send five, five, uh, pictures autographed by the GBC. And I don't even want you to go and like my page. I want you to go and like another local artist that you've never looked into page. Yeah. Do a little research. Show Please. support. Local I'm artists. I'm not doing this for likes. I'm doing this to spread the community. Absolutely. Yeah. And that's what the ghetto booth and booth TV is all about. Um, and you know. If if you can't be showing people support, then you know you shouldn't be around doing what you're doing. Um, positivity. And That's, there's, I also have to say that there's nothing wrong with being focused on your own work. Correct. But don't be too in to your own work to not appreciate all the other work around you. Yeah, absolutely. Everything's beautiful out there. You know, you got to take it in. Um, well, James, I very much appreciate you. I thank you so much for coming and doing this interview. Um, thank you for having me. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, one more time, the, the website was? It's uh, Lost Nights Photography, just right on Facebook or Instagram. I don't actually have a website or anything okay. to say because I just... We're working on that. Yeah, uh, I have fun going out and doing it. For me, the whole process is creating. Yeah. And it's... I never... When I first got into it, I never really saw... Like... um how big photos can hit people yeah the impact the impact yeah absolutely or my, more mine i guess yeah i don't know i just was like having fun doing it and yeah. and we want to keep that yeah. fun alive absolutely so, absolutely so until next time i'm sure we'll have you on again absolutely thank you my friend thank you peace yeah so um you know it's uh it's 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 a good time you know we're having a good time over here in the ghetto booth how right. about you probably be how you feeling Dude, I'm good. Like I said, as long as I keep moving, you yeah. know my yeah, my, my itchy creakies don't don't keep squeaking. Yeah, you know, you'd be like the Tin Man, right? Yeah, well, I just there's no way to get the oil, oil in there. Like, tick, 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 I think the trick is to just keep moving, son. You know, that's all you can do. Yeah, that's all you can do. I mean, you all ready for Christmas? You get all your shopping done? Oh yeah, man. I did. Matter of fact, dude, I went to Walmart to get the last things I always get is gift cards, right? Yeah. And so I thought that was gonna be a nightmare, right? Honestly, getting gift cards was super easy. Yeah. But then, just getting out of the parking lot, it took me... I watched I, I watched pretty much the entire episode one while I was... While just, driving, huh? Yeah, well, no. We don't recommend doing that. No, no, this wasn't driving. <laughs> yeah. This wasn't driving. This was, was this was literally like I would move up a car length in the line of people trying to get out of this place yeah. and then sit there for like five minutes. Oh, all right, and then well. 
It's just fucked up. As long as you have your seatbelt on, buddy. Yeah. No, you need that when Actually, you watch us. Actually, uh, I'm not going to lie. You know, I don't wear the seatbelt. I know that. I don't do that. Right. I know, you, I know that hurts you deep in your heart. Yeah, it does, but, but it's it's uh, your decision. However, I do recommend that everybody wear their seatbelt. I just don't like it. And, you uh, don't but like I don't it. recommend living dangerously like me. Yeah, you know, you got to be a certain type of person live dangerously. Live dangerously. Live dangerously. In fasting. Like, how do you live? I live dangerously. Yeah. My friend. Um, but yeah, I mean, you know, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna show everybody that uh, money now video. Okay, you mean the one that Roach? Yeah, McCracken did boy, for us. A boy, us Dave. Here? Um, you know, we hope Did to Clean we hope Dad to get him crazy on filming on yeah, that. We hope to get him on uh, little, one of the episodes. You know, like little and I have to say that this camera. is probably our most our most professional yeah, put together. Right. Everybody came together. We had the right catering. Day. Um, you know what I mean? And this one's and been up on the Facebook. You know, you never get to see the fire. Um, this one's been up on YouTube for like minute, ten years now. Yeah. So we're going back. We're going um, back. But we're gonna bring this track around and rewind it. Yeah, and we're gonna you know? uh, we're gonna show you people that it's all about progression. You know, you can make all kinds of things, make all kinds of different videos, put in as much effort as you want. You know, but everybody I mean? takes a team, dude. It it takes care. everybody putting in a little bit, doing their little parts. Absolutely. So They're putting uh, a sprinkle, whatever they can, wherever they can yeah. put a little bit of love on it. Yeah. So uh, let's uh, let's go ahead and check out that video, and uh, we'll be back in a second. Money now. I'm just trying to make that money now. BBT, I'm just trying to make that money now. Grano, I'm just trying to make that money now. I'm just trying to make that money now. Yeah. I'm just trying to make that money now. 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 They say I'm living my life wrong, can't hold me down Staying on the grind, just trying to make that money now Writing lines in my room, with my eyes to the moon Praying God hit me soon, let's make this money now Stay by the paper, money maker, yeah. making shit bounce Don't buy the ounce, I'm just trying to make that paper now that money Writing now. lines in my room, with my money. eyes to the moon Praying God hit me soon, let's make this money now I want that money now you want that money now? Cigarellos getting high and never coming down. Round of ballin' bitch, Charlie Sheen no losers here. I'm getting wavy, I think Shorty needs to scuba gear. Shorty going down, ain't no coming up. Only winners, no beginners, fuck the runners up. Side mash, GBC, we the South Shore. Smoking pit, fuck the bitch, while I'm outdoors. Shining like the moon. Hotter than the sun, hear my prayers soon. I'm popping like a gun, blow back my cocky. Back it up, she drop it. Breaking out in the Dutch, got a bunch of bits in my pocket. Body stole my team, shorty writing them jeans. Niggas talking dirty, but that fat boy riding clean. Spit it out when I'm going, every day I'm focused. Shorty need her dosage, I'm the doctor with the prognosis. They say I'm living my life wrong, can't hold me down Staying on the grind, just trying to make that money now Writing lines in my room, with my eyes to the moon Praying God hit me soon, let's make this money now Stay by the paper, money maker, making shit bounce Don't buy the ounce, I'm just trying to make that paper now Writing lines in my room, with my eyes to the moon Praying God hit me soon, let's make this money now I'm just trying to make that money now. You Get owe me room, paper. Yo. Time to give me money yo, count now. Count that out. Count that out, yo. I'm just trying to make that money now. You owe me paper. Time to give me money now. I'm just trying to yeah, make that money now. Like you owe me paper. Time to give me money too. now. I'm just trying to make that money now. You owe me paper. Time to give me money now. I'm money maker. I make paper and I make makers paper. So you better watch your behavior. I make money. I'm a money taker. Cause if you owe me, I'ma take it. What? No questions asked. That was next. And y'all know it's a money concept. But if it's profit, I'm on it. If it's a loss, I'm gonna deduct it. Change the topic. Snap some pop shit. Hip hop or rock shit, we'll drop it. Money chasing us, so it's life in the fast lane. Do. We never think what's next. The money is easy find us, man. They say I'm living my life wrong. Can't hold me down. Staying on the grind. Just trying to make that money now. Writing lines in my room with my eyes to the moon. Praying God hit me soon. Let's make this money now. Stay by the paper. Money maker. Making shit bounce. Don't buy the ounce. I'm just trying to make that paper now. 
writing lines in my room with my eyes to the moon. Playing God in the suit. Let's make this money now. I don't give a fuck if it's dollar bills or go by the hour. Give me euros, pesos, francs, Deutsche Mark, the blue, the crown. I want more than I can count. Cause the only thing that counts is how much you got stashed up in your bank account. And I'm not waiting, I'ma chase it down. Get rich or die trying. Never breath to take a mile to a certain amount. But even getting paid for a mile. If I'm out and about without, then I'ma rob, cheat, and steal until my money count comes back. Cause right, who's acting funny now? Got his eyes in my pockets, gotta put this punk in check. Show some respect to the game and play by the rules. Cause money rules everything around me and the crew. And it's all cool. Do you come and try to fuck around with our bankroll? Ooh, that was the wrong move for your rap to make. Now we blaze it, crew. Witness the rise, we ride for all kinds, even ones and fives. In a hundred lives, I couldn't make half of what I say I like. But I'ma just keep up the chase, keep making a rise. The gettable chronicles, bitches. We just hate the days that we die. Yeah. They say I'm living my life wrong, can't hold me down. Staying on the grind, just trying to make that money now. Writing lines in my room with my eyes to the moon. Praying God hit me soon, let's make this money now. Stay about the paper, money maker, making shit bounce. Nobody out, I'm just trying to make that paper now. Writing lines in my room with my eyes to the moon. Praying God hit me soon, let's make this money now. Yes, sir. Yes. I just, uh, you know, want to definitely thank my boy James for that. Yeah, that's you know, my brother. That was cool. That my was brother. cool, absolutely. Loaded yeah. Lost Nights Photography. Look him up. Yep, that's right. He's, uh, really, he's really with it. He's yeah, got a and, very good eye. And he's got a definitely good, good shit. Like a grasp you know, on it. You know, and it's, and it's like a, it's a night and day thing. It's like not just like, it's like he wakes up really early. Yeah, it's a passion. You know what I'm saying? Passion, and he goes, absolutely. And he'll like take a nap and go out late you know just to shoot the stars and stuff so yeah absolutely and i mean here's the thing too like he's he's done so much photography for yeah. us over the years i he mean just bought, can't even tell you how many shots. shows yeah. right i mean how many shows do you think he's probably taken thousands of pictures yeah, of us a lot you know a, lot, I mean? a lot of pictures uh, yeah. definitely definitely been a good supporter of the gbc so right. well, you know and that's I was, why i wanted to show him some love that, back uh, um, i had this like itching in the back of my head i was thinking it might be a good time for some uh Battle, battle news, news, son. Yeah. Oh, okay. So and you want to do the battle news? Uh, yeah, segment. and I'll even let you go first. Well, if it's you been want. a little while. It's yeah. been a little while. Well, um, a little rusty. Hold yeah. on. I got to. I'm good yeah, to go. Gotta apply yeah. the oil like the tin man. Yeah, I just gotta get. I gotta get everything moving a little bit here. <laughs> you know. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. You want me to go first? I yeah, got I, you, I, I bow to it. You, you go you. first, all right? right? So, uh, you know, check it out. My story comes out of the great state of Kentucky. Kentucky. All right, and um, they got good chicken there. They right? do have good chicken there. Right. You know, they got they got some good stuff out there right. for sure. Um, so, anyways, uh, apparently the cops had to be called um, in a neighborhood for a cousin Eddie decoration oh, Eddie? that some guy did you know who's cousin eddie who, who's cousin eddie well you know it's funny a lot of people might not know who cousin eddie is anymore right. well if you do know who that is that is um randy quaid dennis quaid i think it's randy quaid yeah um and he plays in national lampoon's christmas vacation but so anyways they called the the police because they were getting all kinds of people saying that there was a lewd uh scantily clad uh -huh. man standing out there inappropriately exposing himself <laughs> with a hose yeah <laughs> was it like uh it was uh, just like a model like a fake thing it was just like some guy's decoration up. um so anyways uh like the shepherdsville oak. police chief rick McCuban, McCuban said that the dispatchers Kentucky. were taking all kinds of calls um so the officers uh arrived and it was actually mannequin just a recreation just yeah. a decoration um, but could you imagine that? Yeah, like, right. <laughs> That's messed up. I mean, how like, much? Do you mind taking that decoration down? No, it's not mannequins. What states? Well, I mean, I guess. All year now. I guess. Uh, I guess <laughs> what he should have done was put a little like one of those bubble signs up behind him, like shitter's full. Yeah, right. That way, at least people would have recognized the joke. I yeah, guess right. it was just That's like, a... come on, people. It's like. How you, we get into the point where you're calling the police on decorations. And decorations, like, dude. Come like, on. How fucking crazy. Which well, goes can you back be? to a, a uh, previous thing that I mentioned. It's just crazy. mind your own fucking business, people. Yeah. Mind it. 
Yeah. Mind it. Or, 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 you know? Mind your eyes. Um, but I thought that was pretty funny myself. I mean, it's funny. I mean, I don't, I don't think the story's funny so much. It's just like, all right, so I was reading, and it says, like, Mattel, you know, baby, whatever, American Girl doll, whatever. These companies are starting just now, uh-huh. starting to, like, make toys for adult, like, more adult, just, like, new market. They're trying to market you mean new like toys for adult adults. adult toys. <clears throat> yeah, not like. You know, like, you know, like, play... Like, you know, sex toys. Not sex toys. Not sex toys. Not sex toys. Okay. Like, out in a living room. So just, doll, like, like, play like, with toys Yeah, like mom, and I know, I, just like you were a kid, right? I know, like, I know okay. people that do that anyways. Right. And then, like, they just go and get the stuff from the kids' section. But, you know, they're starting to actually market. Okay. Market their stuff towards, and they're coming up with new products that are more, like, adultish. You know, like... Right. Maybe it's a teenager instead of a baby doll. I don't well, know how, how they would exactly do it. But well, here's the thing that uh, I don't know if that'll work. It's because, an untapped market. Well, dude. here's the whole thing. If you're doing stuff that's like you're getting adult toys, you're marketing to adults, isn't that kind of defeating the purpose of what the adults that are into that are trying to do? I mean, uh, I guess maybe. I mean, they're probably just going to put like a different logo on it or something. And yeah. Maybe put a little bit of hair on the face or something. I don't, I don't, I don't understand how it's going to work, but you know like <laughs> Put a little well, hair on I just think that's a... Uh, that's a that's an interesting subject. I thought it was cool. Yeah. I mean, just, you know. Yeah, that was absolutely. There's money everywhere. Yeah, absolutely. There's you know? money everywhere. Money well, everywhere. Honestly, you know, I think I'm going to retract the whole battle news set, uh, concept of this because that really wasn't a battle news. It wasn't. That it was, was just more like a current event. Conversation. Yeah. But I still yeah, want to call it battle news. In oh, my sleep. you still want to call it battle yeah, news. Yeah, that's when I. Well, if it's truly battle yeah. news, then I guess people can go on and vote for those stories. If you want to, if not, I just thought, you know, a little bit of news for the people yeah. out there. Yeah, just a little bit of a little Christmas bit of time stuff. cheer. You know, we're not doing Christmas colors, so we don't do shit like that. No. No. We don't dress up like Santa Claus. Actually, this guy kind of is a little red checking yeah. ass. <laughs> well, whatever. Yeah. Whatever, okay? Right. At least I shaved. You know what I, mean? I did shave last night, bro. <laughs> He's like, I like the, the five o'clock I'm shower. I'll leave it. I'm I'm one, like, number one, I'm bro. Like, I do. I did. I shaved last night. Did you? Yeah, because my, yeah. my hair started folding up and it made my nose itchy and shit. So it was like, well, shaved it all. Shaved it all down. Yeah. And then from right here down, completely bald. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. That I do uh, use a straight blade uh, for. <laughs> no, that would be crazy. Yeah, it would be. Yeah. That. I would never do that. All right. um, no, but yeah, itchy. I mean... It'd be too itchy, yeah, though. It, it would be, it'd be, it'd be bad. Right? It'd definitely be bad. Um, yeah, definitely. But, you know, it, it's a, it's a good time of year, you know. I'm hoping that everybody out there has a, a, very a pleasant merry holiday. holiday sure. season. Um, we merry, thank you again for anybody that's joined season. us. And, uh, Thanks, James. Lost Night Photography. I guess that. we could do that 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 part. Let's see. You can follow us on Facebook. Facebook, right? Booth, Booth TV. Booth TV. Uh, what else? Polly P B M C Yeah. But like spell weird, I don't know. I didn't set that one up for myself. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, yeah. Um but you know, you can also check out some of our music over on SoundCloud. SoundCloud, you know Ghetto I mean? Booth. And and don't forget uh you can always follow us on YouTube. Follow us. Like, you can just chat with us. Here's share, up like, hey, what's happening, subscribe. my friends? You know what I mean? What you all about today? We you get together I mean? and we smoke. Absolutely. I don't know. We you smoke, know. we get high, we do our thing. And then we get and then um, you just move on. Son. And again, if you want to, uh, if you want to come and and fuck around, yeah, with you're the, doing something fun, uh, yeah. interesting. You want to share with everybody? We yeah. come, we'll give you a little interview. We come on, come back. on, and hang out. Maybe we come to you. You never know. Yep. Right. I mean, it's just the beginning of the message we're trying it's to spread. It's just the beginning of the message we're trying to spread. That's right. That's right. And uh, on that note, we're on gonna that leave note, you. We're gonna leave you with with. A live performance that we did at the Gong Show. Gong Show. And our good friend Jack Savini hooked us up That's right. with the gig. And it was a really good time. A lot of really cool people. Yep, absolutely. Low-key, mellow, not like hanging out with smoke joints. You could drink if you wanted to. I didn't, but, yeah, you know. Yeah. And for, uh, th- we actually did a mashup of two songs, so, uh, you know, we hope you enjoy them. That was quick. And again, uh, thank you for all those that thank keep you, tuning in. Thank you. We thank shall be back again. Thank you over here and you over there. And a very Merry Christmas Boop TV the out, Ghetto Booth Chronicles. What up? Oh, here we go. With the Ghetto Booth Chronicles, BBT and Polly P. Hands together, everybody. Hands together. The Jersey Shore. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thanks, boss. Hello. Woo! Uh, how's everybody doing out there tonight, huh? Woo! Woo! We are the Ghetto Booth Chronicles. 
And we're gonna perform some original hip hop for y'all, so hope you enjoy. Jack, whenever you're ready, set it off. Are you okay if my sister borrows this chair to bring this for her? Yeah. Thank you for having us here tonight. It's been a nice show. It's kind of hard to follow some of those acts, but we're going to do our best. Yeah. Check. I'm going to give you all that I can. Put in all that I can. Provide you with everything that you desire. And never passing the chance to show you my dedication to being your man. I just want you to know that you get your heart, my body, and my soul. I'll never let you go. My mind is so unbreakable. And I'm going to do whatever I can to make you feel comfortable. Never make you feel insecure. And if my words don't work, then I'll let my actions speak to prove my worth. The worst thing I do is not put you first. But I promise to never stop. I'm putting in the word for you. Yeah. Just tell me what you need and I'll be right there for you. I never let you down in this I song is you. So tell me what you want and I'll go out and get it for you. For you. I give my life to you. Give a little love, give a little love, put a little love into everything. Put a little love, put a little love, put a little love into everything you do. Take a little time, share a little smile every time you put a little love in it with the right spike, with the right night. Make all your dreams come true. 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 Make all your d